What is up, Obscure Mic people? It is Bart coming at you with another handheld dynamic microphone review. And it's the array. We've got, whoa, 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 I don't want to say it. We got one from the shack. That's what I wanted to say. We got one from the shack. The shack of radio. Radio Shack 33-3004. Handheld dynamic microphone that I've had for years and have never put to the channel. But I built a buddy of mine a podcast setup, and I figured it was high time to go ahead and uh, throw this one on the channel in a quick two to three minute video because that's what handheld dynamics end up being on this channel. So that being said, let's do some tests and stuff. You can get this for about 20, you know, usually less 10 to $20 Radio Shack. Usually those Radio Shack mics were made by Sure. A lot of them were. I don't know about this one. I want to say it was. I'm not 100%, but let's do some handling noise first and foremost. Not good. That's some of the worst handling noise I've heard on a mic in a while, but I digress. Let's do more tests. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle pineapple pizza. And when you get right on top of the 33004, this is what it sounds like when you are right on top of this cheap shack from radio microphone this is what that sounds like off axis rejection time going to turn the microphone 90 degrees off axis rejection it's good it's a dynamic 180 degrees off axis rejection 90 degrees yet again and then back around to the front of the microphone i'm excited just to get some of this stuff out of here my shack not a radio just a podcast shack is uh, very full and I'm very glad to get rid of a lot of this stuff. So this for 10 to $20, I think has a, a decently solid sound. It's just kind of samey. It's fine. There's nothing overly wrong with it. It's just like middle of the road. And for that matter, I'm going to give it a six on the BBSAR. It's okay. I mean, it's fine. No big deal. Whatever. If you see one, you need to, you know, see if you like podcasting or like content creating, or you know, you're going to do a YouTube channel and you don't care that the audio is just solid and not spectacular. This is fine. Absolutely fine. That's all I got. Bark Radio Shack 33 is out of here. See you guys next time on Obscure Mics. Peace out.